Not sure about you, but for us, there's only one way to celebrate 3 million subscribers. And that's with a 30 pound fried chicken sandwich. 30 pounds. Oh, what does 30 pounds of chicken look like, Sam? How about it looks like <laughs> this, this. It's 30 mother effing pounds. And so we've gone back and forth. Do we do individual pieces? Do we, do we grind it up and make like a giant patty? But what do we do? So we saw Twisted online take three chicken breasts and bash them together and then turn that into a chicken bun thing or whatever. So we're doing that, but not with three breasts, with 27. Not 27 that way, 27 this way. Because you gotta make them, bash them flat, freeze them, get them in egg and flour and all that nonsense. Stand by for the 1937 biplane. They just, the Wright brothers just flew right over top of the house. So you gotta, you gotta flatten them, you gotta freeze them, you gotta flour them, you gotta egg them, you gotta panko them, then you gotta fry them. And there's only, ooh, I can't get a bun this big. We're going like this. But there's gonna be, we think nine layers and some sauce some lettuce and whatever. It's all good though, it's all, is it all good? Hell yeah. Because I'm a little worried right now. It's gonna take a while. Let's just put a clock on this. It's 2.15. If I remember, I'll tell you when we're done. We gotta start though by getting the chicken in place. This is ridiculous. I don't know why we're doing this. I said, let's just give a dollar to three million people and Max was like, no, that's no fun. I go, okay, $2 to a million and a half people. He goes, no, we're making the biggest effing chicken sandwich anybody's ever made. Well, I don't know if that's true, but it's gonna be big. Should we call the Guinness Book of World Records really people? We'll look up the Guinness nonsense while we're prepping our chicken. Cause if we don't do this, it can't go in the freezer. And if it doesn't go in the freezer, it doesn't go in the stuff. If it doesn't go in the stuff, it doesn't go in the oil, it doesn't go in the bun, we got nothing. Here we go. We begin by making a bed of uh, plastic wrap or cling film or saran, whatever the hell you call this. Look at what's that? Okay, so I need the, basically two full of these. Stay nice. Like that. Look at it. I hate this shit. Somebody's got to come up with one. Okay, so now we get another one. We overlap a little bit, not underlap. Stupid, I said overlap, God. Oh boy, we're off to an amazing start. Okay, so here's what we do. We take a breast, a giant one. We're gonna put it on here and we're gonna butterfly it. That means we're gonna open it up like a book just to make this easier. All right, then again, we go like this and again. I'm not trying to be funny, but seriously, these are like the largest breasts I've ever seen. Great. Now you take more saran, and when you've got them all covered, you get to bash them to an even thickness. So the goal is get them relatively flat and even, and then overlap them. And remember, you want this in a generally circular style. Well, you don't know, but it's a, a round loaf that this is going on. Okay, so here's what's gonna happen. The next couple minutes of you watching will be just this happening. I don't need to leave commentary every second. And now we continue. What you got here is your basic three-part dredging station. We are gonna season our flour a bit. By a bit, I mean quite a lot because there's a lot of chicken. So lots of salt and pepper right there. Garlic powder right there. Might as well empty it. And some smoked paprika right there. Now we'll just give it some of this. And let's remember, we have nine of these and it's cut down as you can see. So we begin. How do I do this? So we carefully pick up our chicken frisbee and first into the flour, making sure it's well coated. Both sides, this is the dumbest thing I think we've ever done here, boys. I'm stoked. Well, I'm happy for you. We just should have had 75 people here to consume this with us. You don't really want these warm fingerprints because that will keep the egg from sticking. Gotta get up underneath it, make sure it all gets covered. Beautiful, I know what that is. Edges too, don't forget them. All right, here we go. And into the panko, 
after it drips a bit like this. Let me give my hands a quick rinse. And now we're gonna try and get this guy covered. Oh boy, what a task we have at hand here, folks. What a task. And of course, you know, getting these things completely level and flat was, is a challenge. But we need a good coating here, so regardless of what you're dealing with, do your best. Should always be the answer. And when you think you've got enough coverage on your chicken frisbee, just take it over and put it in. Gentlemen, here comes number one. And it's... Oh, yes. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. And we began, look, we've even got fire over here. Because <laughs> some of the oil spilled out. Damn it. Come Please on, Please don't kill us. Oh my god. It's like a trick birthday candle. I know. <laughs> 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 I got you. I did that. Oh my god. Epic prank. Uh, how long is this going to take? Okay. Here's what we're doing. I hope people appreciate this struggle. Here's what I'm gonna do. Ah, I can't even do this, it's so hot. Wait, you wanna know the worst part about it? Yeah. I wasn't rolling audio. You weren't? <laughs> F Are you rolling now at least? Yeah, yeah. All right, so here's what I'm gonna do. Turns out Max wasn't rolling audio on that, us putting it in. So I don't know what the fuck that means, but I wanna get this happening faster than not. Get another pan on here with some oil. Start this heating up, don't spill. Oh, this is so much smaller. Other oil's gonna come out the side. This is just gonna be awful. Wait, let me go check and see where we're at here. It's pretty crispy. All right, here we go. Now I've got no place to put my, to get this out from. I've got a heat warning. Okay, this comes out. Oh, I gotta put it there. Don't worry, I got my cell phone. Oh, fabulous. Three million. We're on a cell phone. All right, let me turn this kid. No, can't do that. That's too hot to use my hand. So I'll use this, and I'll do this, and I'll do this, and oh, look how pretty that is. And then we try and do this, and gently lay it in like this. There we go. Beautiful! Oh, my voice cracked. Like a prepubescent young lad. Okay, I, can I go take a shower? I am sweating, I'm coated with fucking oil. Okay, so this is, ah, fuck. God damn it. Oh, fuck, fuck. Ow, oh, fuck. Oh my God. Baby, fuck, uh-oh. That's a problem. Ow, hot, it's gotta come out. God, if I'm alive at the end of this, I'm gonna be very happy. And I'm gonna be very surprised. Shit. What, that I'm alive or happy? Yes, that you're alive. Fucking hell. And we repeat the process. Into the flour, covered nicely. Top and bottom, no fingerprints. Please, I gotta tell you something. This, so far, the entire process of this has been one big effing hassle, but I am very excited to see the outcome. If you're gonna do a three million subscriber special, it can't just be an easy nothing video. No, it can't be. They have to see a struggle. Backside, which is the difficult side because it's concave. Of all the things I do with my hands, I can't believe you are not being grossed out <laughs> by this. Yeah, it's not the best. But you don't like it when I mix beef with my hands. How's this? Uh-oh, uh-oh, somebody got some eggshell. Oh. And is Somebody. Who did that? I better chat with them later. All right, and ah, in we go. You can't go with egg hands straight into the panko. You need to give yourself a bit of a fighting chance. So a quick rinse, and then, fucking hell, fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, okay, I don't know what we're doing for four million, but please let me get the proper size dishes and stuff. I don't know, we might have to stop this or one day we're gonna be doing something that's 100 pounds. I'm okay with that. If we're at that number, <laughs> I'm okay with however it goes down. I just want the proper sized containers for whatever it is I have to do. I will say there's something about the struggle being real that's kind of more fun. Okay, a little bit more here. You ready? Let's get in the oil. And in we go. Next one up. Hi guys. There you go. 
There you go, burn away, you piece of shit. This is not helping, this fucking burning. We're in our feelings? What does that mean? I guess I'll go take this in. All right, here's number four, or 10, or no idea what the, which one this is. And I wish I could just do this. And because I'm at the point of almost not caring, I will. There you go. Here we are. This guy's coming out. Oh my goodness. All right, this guy comes out. We get him inside to the oven. We get two more in these pans. All right, five to go. Here's one. And look how uh, wonky this one is. It'll, it'll straighten out in a bit, but right now it's very that. And in our small pan to the side, we go in. Oh, it barely fits. Oh, please don't bubble over. Please don't bubble over. Oh, look, it's fine. Okay, we're good. If by good I mean having the worst time ever cooking 30 pounds of frickin' chicken, yeah, then I'm great. All right, I think this guy I can turn. He said, trying not to burn it the hell out of himself. Stand up, buddy. Oh, wow. Look at that gorgeous piece. Nice. Jackie's coming for dinner, comma, and I'm not cooking, period. Period, 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 period. All right, another one. Doesn't bite the dust, but comes out of the hot oil. Rest there, we'll get that inside. We can get ready to put another one in that pan. And in we go. Numero, nobody knows what number this is. Oh boy. And it's too big for the pan. Oh boy, it'll shrink. It'll be fine. I won't be, that'll be fine. Okay, and this kid's coming now. Well, we're fast and furious at this point, ladies and gentlemen. Out we go. Uh-oh, starting to crack a bit. We'll be okay, we'll be okay. Get that in the oven, get another one in. We're all good. All right, this guy's ready. Oh, fucking hell. Okay. Oh, I gotta flip it. And the little guy gets one. One for the little kid, there we go. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. If I'm not mistaken, there's one more after that, is that right? That's it. Praise the Lord. All right, this is a seven of nine. That means there's two more, and then we build. All right, let's get this kid inside. And number nine comes out. Number eight comes out. No, nope. oh yeah, number eight comes out. It goes here, we get it inside, the oil gets hot again, and we come back with our last one. And last but not least, I have to put it in using my hands like a man, because, I don't know, that was stupid. I don't know why I had to do that, but I had to. The last one had to be finished off that way. But if I was a real man, I'd be taking it out with my hands, which I'm not going to, so I'm not a man, so forget it. Do it, do you it. You stop it. Please don't let this be the one that takes me out. All right, flipping the last one. Please don't let this be the one that finishes me off. Oh, it's looking pretty good, actually. Shan't be saving this oil for anything, I can tell you that much. So we're looking at number nine, our ninth layer of the 30 pound plus chicken sandwich. When this is done, out it comes. And when you see us next, we'll be building. And boy, what a sight that will be. Ah! Oh my God, stop burning yourself. You've done that 45 times. And there they are, 32, three pounds. I can't remember what it was. Absolutely over 30, all gorgeous. But now we gotta turn it into a sandwich. So, we got a big sourdough guy here, which is beautiful. I'm gonna cut, hope I don't jack this up. I need kind of a decent sized base because it's so big. I mean, you know, it's like a pyramid, right? If you don't have the right base for your pyramid, all the shit just topples over. And nobody wants to see that happen. Here, do we, boys? After all the work we put in, no. After all the work we put in, ah, oh, lovely. Okay, I'm gonna throw these on the flat top. Let's give it a little 
Oh, it's hotter than I thought. That's okay. Why should that? God, everything is hot today, man. Look at this. That's a big base. That's a big base. You know, 30 pounds of chicken is sitting on this base when I get there. God, I'm a little scared. You're scared, yeah. A little more for this guy. Oh, fine, you too. Perfect. Just burnt myself with hot butter. I have burnt myself maybe 12 times today. And I'm not happy about it. Should we look? How's that look? Awesome. 30 seconds. Chance did the angels. <laughs> oh, mother. Okay, let's do this, shall we? Perfection. And this little kid. Come off, buddy. Oh, you are really pretty. All right, I'll set you here. And here's how we begin. We're going to start with some mayo. We're going pretty simple here. And in case there are any Duke's Mayo people watching, I've heard you. I get your notes, your comments. I know. You love it. So I thought I would give you a present on this, our 3 millionth subscriber video. I know. A lot of Mayo, Sam. Uh, well, two things. One, it's not just Mayo. It's Duke's. But more importantly, it's a big-ass sandwich. And now, some dill pickle like this. <laughs> Beautiful. Exactly what I was hoping this would do. Scatter gorgeous little dilly bites. Something's going our way. For once. One thing today is working. All right. Have you got enough pickles? Let's put it this way. It's more than McDonald's gives you. Alan? Alan. Now we need some lettuce. Lewis, you all right? And I've gone with romaine cut like that. Nice and frilly, cool, crispy, and lacy. Tiny bit more. Lewis. Lewis is choking on probably some chicken or something that fell. And now we begin. We take one of our... <laughs> this is so dumb, I can't believe it. I can't believe what's happening here. On. I don't know how to do this, man. And there's no particular order for any of this, so I'll just try and get one that I think will work best. And I hope it's this kid. Oh boy. I can tell you something, this is gonna be way bigger looking than I even imagined. All right, here we go. That's two, and here comes three, I guess. Wow. Four, five, six. Oh, I feel like we're starting to lean a bit. Seven. Oh God, I'm a little tippy. Eight. And nine. Oh my God, please don't fall. Uh oh, shit, S. S, 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 S. Oh boy. And last but not least, ladies and gentlemen, can you imagine if the bun fucked it up and it fell over? And the crowning, oh God. And the crowning, oh God. Crowning. Oh, God. Oh, did you just hit it? Yeah. I did it on purpose, just to get you mad. I'm going to put some mayo on the lid, because maybe the lid will help keep it in place. Just a little, a little pop of color. Here we go. And I actually think it's fairly stable. And in case you just tuned in and uh, think your eyes are playing tricks on you, no, you're actually not. That's nine layers of a fried chicken sandwich, over 30 pounds of just the chicken. Forget the breading, forget the bread, forget the, there's actually lettuce down there and pickles and mayo. That is not an insignificant chicken sandwich that I think it's time to have a bite of. A little bite. You tell me, what do you think? How do we do? I'll tell you this. What's that expression about the end being better than the journey? <laughs> I will be 100% straight with you, ladies and gentlemen. Max and I fought all the way through this. From the second this concept was proposed. Up until about two minutes ago. Up until two minutes ago. And now we love each other again. Uh, but now I must take a bite. Now it looks like it's about to tilt this Now way. I know. Uh, it needs help. <laughs> oh, shit. I can't. I just can't. I think it's just, it's, it's. Oh, there we go. There. That's good. All right, time for a bite. So. How are you going to do it? I, I think I'm just going to do this. No, no. <laughs> but you know what? Here, show this. It's cooked beautifully. It's perfect. 30 pounds of perfectly cooked chicken. Mmm. It's still moist and tender. 
Can you still say moist? All right, this was to celebrate our three million. I've got stuff all over my glasses. I've had grease on me the entire afternoon. This was to celebrate our three millionth subscriber and we thank you guys for it. And we promised you some fun giveaway stuff and that begins Monday. Whew. I don't need a bath, I need like six baths and a shower. Holy shit, it's not good.